let's take a look at finding permutations where your items are all different in the R language. So I'm going to do a file, new script, and then I'll go ahead and do a file save. And um, permutations items different. Dot R. Now, if there is a function for this, I couldn't locate it. Um, so we're going to base our, our work based upon the formula. And the problem we're going to actually look at is this one here. So uh, the P is for permutations, and out of 30, we want to pick 5. Now, this is our formula for um, the permutation rule, where items are all different. And um, it's n factorial over n minus r factorial. So we need n and r. So I'm going to say n is equal to 20, and r is equal to, um, or 30 and 5, I guess you should say. 30 and 5. Not that matters for this testing. And then uh, I'm going to calculate um, the permutation. Permutation is equal to, and remember what, what our formula said, n factorial over n minus r factorial. So I'm going to say factorial n divided by factorial n minus r. Now the factorial is a function in r that we're calling. So uh, again, that's n factorial and that's n minus r factorial. And then I'll print it. So let's save this and do an edit um, run all. And we go to my console, so do my window and our console. And put, put commas in there, that's 17,100,720 different uh, possibilities uh, given, given this setup. Now that I've saved this off, if I want to calculate permutations where the items are different from now on, all I have to do is come up here and change an N and R and then um, run this and that'll give me my answer. Now I could set these up as true true functions and so forth but I'm just creating very simple scripts for this. In this um, video we took a look at how to uh, find uh, permutations um, where all items are different uh, using the R language.